What is going on everybody? My name is Flair. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're showing you guys how to set up and install these softwares for the Roland Bridgecast Dual Buzz Gaming Mixer. This is Roland's first stab at a device for streamers slash constant creators. I've been using it for the past month or two now and let me tell you it's pretty freaking gnarly. But let's hop right into the video. The Bridgecast will come with two cords. A USB-C to USB-C cord and a USB-C to USB cord. The USB-C to USB-C cord goes into the far right side of the Bridgecast. Then you want to plug the other side into an outlet. You might need a brick to plug into the outlet just like me. The other the USB-C cable will plug into the next one over on the bridge cast. Then the USB side goes into your PC. Next up is your XLR mic. Plug the male side of the XLR cord into the second slot on the left, then the other side of the cord into the mic. Lastly, plug your headset into the far left. You can also use this as a reference to plug everything in as well. I have a link to this in the description below. Just like that, you are done setting up. Now let's go ahead and download the software. Go to the description to find the download link of the bridge cast software. If you ever get lost, they tell you exactly how to install and do everything although it is really easy and you really shouldn't have much of an issue just scroll down on the page go ahead and click i agree click download file the bottom of the same side you'll see it will load up just go ahead i always click show in folder make sure you click on the folder go to compress folders holes extract all extract wherever you want doesn't matter where once you've extracted it open the folder and then click the installer and install the application all right so once you download the software it's going to look kind of something like this now the first thing you're going to want to do is make sure your first four knobs are the things you want i have mic system game and chat this one's for discord this one's for the game obviously this one's for like you know google chrome and stuff like that and the mic is literally just the mic and then you have these three as well they're not going to be actually on the bridge cast itself you can't change the knobs but you can go in on the software and move them up and down if you want one of these to be on the knobs just go to the menu go to channels and then click channel four three whichever knob you want to change if i want to change number four say i want to move it to music go ahead and click music We'll go back and now we see music is on channel four but i'm gonna go back and change it to chat because i like my discord on my johns now this is how you're gonna put the game audio to the game knob the discord to the chat mix the google chrome tv system whatever you guys want go ahead hop into the sound settings on your computer Let's click here we see your default output put it to system or whatever you want i have mine on system and then my input obviously put it on the mic bridge cast when you click on the drop down this is what it looks like you're gonna see some of these this is, these are like my monitors and stuff like that but you'll see system music chat all your like your four main ones and the additional ones as well you'll be able to see but from here just scroll down a little bit you'll see advanced sound options click app volume and device preferences go inside there and you'll see all the pop-ups now when you're in here the only thing that's going to pop up are the applications you have open so so I have Discord open, I have Valorant, I have Streamlabs, I got Google Chrome, and then obviously the software. Every time you open up a new game, you're going to have to go into the sound settings, click on the routing, and make it go to the game sound. That way it routes to your bridge cast. I know it's a little bit tedious, but it's worth. But once you do it one time, it should be there forever. So since I just did it with Valorant just now, I should have that preset audio forever. Same with Google Chrome, same with Discord. Every time I open up those applications on my PC, it'll automatically route to the chat knob on my Bridgecast. And that's pretty much all you need to know as a setup. There's obviously way more stuff when it comes to this. Roland just added this new thing. It's coming soon. I don't really know what it is. The Roland Cloud BGM beta. You can also mess with like delays if you got, you know, different delays on your video to your sound. Here's your chat. You can do compressors, all that kind of stuff. This is your game mix. So like if you want to use the COD preset, maybe it makes the footsteps louder or a Valorant or whatever it is there's mic effects there's mic cleanup there's mic setup i mean there's a whole bunch of different things you can do to help improve your sound audio it's insane but that's pretty much all you guys need to know that's going to be the video i hope this was helpful maybe maybe not i don't know if not i am sorry truly i am that's unfortunate for real F in the chat all right that's it go kill it out there as always Mr. Lair, and i'm out peace